Good morning. The time is now 8.30, and we have breaking news for you right now. A bus crash has four people in the hospital, including students, in DeKalb County. Atlanta News First, Madeline Montgomery is live along the intersection of Lamar Street and Covington Highway, where the bus has been towed, and she's got some brand new information as we've been keeping a track on this. Uh, Madeline, what's the school district saying this morning? We just found out from the school district that it was a student from Peachcrest Elementary School and a student from Bethune Elementary School who were on the bus at the time of this accident. That accident happening right here at Lamar Street and Covington Highway. The bus and the SUV just getting towed away about 10 minutes ago. And the good news that we're hearing from the school district is that the two students and the driver on the bus were not severely injured. In fact, they were taken to the hospital just as a precautionary measure, according to the school district, just to make sure that they were looked over, checked out, but they believe they will be absolutely all right. Now we have video from our chopper this morning where you could really see the damage to the SUV involved in this accident. We're hearing from DeKalb County Fire that this white SUV that looks like a Jeep ran into the back of the bus, completely tearing up the front of the Jeep. And we're told that the driver of that Jeep actually had to be cut out of their vehicle and the driver was rushed off to Grady and we're told by firefighters that that driver was in critical condition. So four people all together going to Grady due to this accident, which happened around 630 this morning and it was holding up traffic here for a while, but now all lanes are open out here now and we're going to keep in contact with firefighters to keep learning about the condition of the driver of that SUV. But we are glad to hear that those students and the bus driver in this situation were OK. We really didn't see a whole lot of damage to the bus. We could see that the under part of the back of the bus was a little bit torn up and did have to be toned away. But other than that, it really wasn't damaged too much. We're going to keep in contact with the district to find out how they are once we get checked over. But for now, reporting live in DeKalb County, I'm Madeline Montgomery, Atlanta News First. All right, Madeline, keep us